everybody. Welcome to my first edition of Let's Get Political. Let's just jump right into this. Women's Magazine Marie Claire has been criticized as irresponsible by medical experts after suggesting that women can insert parsley into their vaginas. So the title of the article is Women Shouldn't Put Parsley Into Their Vaginas. The reason is because according to doctors, there's no evidence of any benefit to women doing this and there's clear risk of harm and deaths have been reported. So yes, there was a death reported that had parsley something to do with an, a self-induced abortion um, last year. So what the internet did is Marie Claire put up this DIY about a parsley douche and then the internet went and found something you know, criminalized parsley and told and basically attacked Marie Claire for their irresponsible actions. So this doctor goes on to say, I would I would urge women not to insert anything unless they have taken proper medical advice. So women, that means you should go talk to your gynecologist before you handle your own vagina. Okay, make sure you do that. This article makes me madder as I read it. <laughs> Okay, the next doctor reiterates and says, this is not something recommended by gynecologists. There are only a few things that should go into your vagina and vegetables generally aren't one of them. So I'd like to first know, what does generally mean? And secondly, what exactly is safe to put into our vaginas? Like everything at the doctor's office, is that safe to put into to our vaginas? Or how about everything down the grocery store aisle or the CVS? store, the drug store, that's geared toward our vaginas. And that would include scissors, sharp metal objects, vice grips, clamps, approved medical supplies, cauterization tools, vacuums, ointments, creams, sponges, foams, jellies, sprays, perfumes. The list goes on and on, but parsley off the table, ladies. This article is not about protecting the interests of women. It's about shaming, condemning, and ridiculing anybody who steps beyond the line of conventional and mainstream protocol. Women have been using herbs to freshen their vaginas for millennia. If the independent and other news agencies want to be the pussy police, I suggest they start reporting on the deaths, fatalities, and illnesses caused by approved products. It's unfortunate that this is how the news is reported these days. It has nothing to do with facts or the interest of, of any particular person. It's just about finding something wrong and attacking. That's where we're at right now. I'm not sure how we got here, but this is where we're at. And it's time to sort of question how we got here and take back our power. This is really disempowering. So thanks for listening to my first edition of Let's Get Political. Let me know what you think about your vagina being policed. Leave a comment below and uh, have a great day. Bye.